Happy Sunday, everyone. Uh, Simply Natu here. Um, we are gonna go up to the garden, and I think today we are going to plant all the seedlings that I had grown from seed and a couple of starts that I bought from the store. Anyways, uh, come watch me do it. Hope you enjoy the video. Bye. Okay guys, so this is the garden. Here's where we're at. Um, these three bags are ready for planting and then I'm gonna set up these four over there. I have more grow bags coming in today, um, but I also wanted to show you something really cool. So the other day I was out here um, setting up the bags, the last video I posted, and I planted some zinnias and look at, they're coming up y'all. Isn't that cool? That's just so cool. I think I'm gonna plant some more flowers today. Okay, all right, let's get to what I'm supposed to be doing, which is setting up the rest of these grow bags. Um, cutting down that giant weed, geez Louise, and uh, um, getting ready to plant what's in the greenhouse. I gotta open that up. All right, bye. Okay guys, so this is what it's looking like so far. Um, this is my pepper bed for the most part. I have mostly sweet um, hot peppers, sweet peppers in here, um, but I have like a couple of the hot peppers on the outside here. And then on this bed over here are my uh, Jamaican scotch bonnet and um, just spreading them out. Um, let me show you what I got with the tomatoes over here. Those are the tomatoes. And we're gonna get these all planted out. I have the squash, corn, um, melons, and all the other stuff in the greenhouse. And those I will start hardening off next week. But for now, these guys are well and ready to go into the ground. So that's what I'm gonna do. All right. Okay, so here's where we're at. This is our cherry tomato bed. So these are Super Sweet 100. Um, I have five of them right here and then over here these are my yellow pears I have three um, that's a celebrity that my mom had forever it's just starting to blossoming um, and then I have a random um, watermelon seed that just fell out of the package and I just plunked it in um, and planted it and it started growing so I know I'm probably gonna regret this, but I'm gonna put it right here. I know this thing is not strong enough to hold it up, but we'll figure it out. And over there, what I have is, hold on, let me get a better view. Over here, I have um, the pink brandy wine, and I have three of those. Now we're gonna fill up those beds with other things. Um, this bed too, probably gonna put um, maybe more melon in there. Probably not a good companion plant for tomatoes, but gotta try. Over here is, I know it looks a little full, but that is my Jamaican Scotch Bonnet peppers and the Lola banana peppers and one random right here, jalapeno. And then over here, I have red bell peppers, sweet, um, a green bell pepper, then I have the California Wonders. I think I have two of those. And I have two little ones right here that I'm gonna plant to see how well they do. Um, I was gonna plant some thyme in here as well, but we'll see. Maybe I'll just put some, actually I'm gonna leave the thyme here and put some marigolds in the other plant in the tomato beds. Um, but yeah, then I have three habanero plants right here. I have two Tabasco plants right here. I have two lemon dream right here and then i have california wonder california wonder and then i have one random lola banana pepper here so let's see how this goes y'all i'm just gonna go ahead and plant and i'm gonna show you what it looks like after now there is plenty of videos out there on how to plant these things especially tomatoes and how deep you plant them and whatever not i am gonna use some um uh organic fertilizer um to mix in while i'm doing that and I'm going to also use um, some blood meal when I'm planting each of these plants when I um, make a hole for them. So maybe I'll show you when I do just one plant 
Um, but yeah, this is what the garden is looking like right now. Um, and I ran out of soil, thought I had enough, but I didn't. So I have to get these two bags filled up for when I start planting next week, the corn, the okra, and all those other things that I have from seed. So yeah, looking good so far. I'm gonna get to planting. I'm gonna plant the tomatoes first, then I'll move on to the peppers. Um, and anyways, yes, yeah, so what I was saying, I, I keep jumping over the place, forgive me. Um, so this was a dog kennel that we had and we took it apart when we moved. And like I said, I have a huge pest problem here um, where I live, um, which is, I never say before. So I live in um, Ramona, California. And uh, right now it, it gets super hot up here and it also gets super cold. So we're zone 9AB, I believe. Um, but yeah, this is what we have. Okay. Um, yeah, let's get to planting guys. Okay, so super sweet 100 right here. Uh, I've been hardening these guys off for over a week. Um, and I'm gonna plant them super deep. Um, I have some blood meal and I have some nature's care um organic fertilizer so i'm gonna put these two in the hole and go from there all right okay here we go i am not gonna show you planting me planting every single one i'm just gonna do this one pepper plant right here so that you can see what i'm doing and that's it so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna dig a deep hole deep hole oh there we go all the way down and I'm gonna, yeah, oh, that should be good enough. And then down here, I'm gonna add some bone meal. And then I'm gonna add some of the, woo, don't you spill bone meal. Goodness. Um, and then the other thing, which I don't have, is I'm gonna add some eggshells to here. So let me go get those and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, you guys. So I've been saving these for a while. I've crunched them up. And I am going to just put a little bit of them when I plant. And these are only for the tomatoes that I'm doing this for. Okay, so they're super dry one now. I watered them yesterday, but I left them out in the sun. So there we go. Like I said, worse for wear, worse for wear. So here we go, all the way down. I hope you guys can see that. And then we're gonna cover that up and then we're gonna water in it real, real good. Okay. Should have actually planted it deeper to be honest with you. But we're just gonna do that instead. Okay. The next one I'll plant deeper. Firmly press down. And that is it y'all. Super sweet, 100 planted. I'm gonna stick that over here so I can see it. This is my super sweet 100 bed. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of them. You guys, I am tired. But after being out here since from about one o'clock, it's now uh, 5.48, I'm finally finished I believe so got everything planted um, and like I said I have a pest problem so I have raccoons squirrels rabbits birds even you name it I got it and so like I did on this side a while back to protect my stuff it has been working quite well I just threw some bird netting over this as well um, just to help protect it i also did a couple of additional things um i added um some forks especially by my tomatoes because i'm not sure they're gonna touch the peppers that pepper has been out here for a while and they haven't touched it um and then i sprinkled um god i don't remember what it is but it's like a rabbit and squirrel and um thing repellent and it's organic you can put it on plants so i sprinkled it all over the beds um 
sorry, my dog is playing with her ball. Um, so I sprinkled it all over the beds and um, watered everything in. And I'm hoping that this is gonna be enough to keep them out until the plants are mature enough that they can't do too much damage or they won't want to go near it. So this is where I'm at. Um, it's getting dark, it's like 5.48 like I said. Um, I gotta get more soil for those two bags because I have more plants in the greenhouse to, that I have to harden off next week and then plant the week upcoming weekend. And I got some 15 gallon grow bags. It's that green bag right there. Um, I planted some sweet potatoes in there today that was had sprouted in um, the house. And um, what else? Yeah, so everything is looking okay. I'm hoping they look good. My brandy wines are looking a little bit yellow, y'all. See that yellow one? So I'm hoping being in the ground is gonna perk them up quite a bit. Um, this bed, I think I might have overplanted a little bit, but hey, it is what it is. I have five re um, cherry red, no, super sweet 100 um, tomato plants in here with some marigolds. I don't think I'm gonna put anything else in here. Over here, I have the three yellow pears and some marigolds and one stray melon right there. Um, right here, I have the three brandy wine um, and three marigolds, and that's it. And then, like I said, over here, that's most sweet and hot mixed. And then over here is mostly my Jamaican scotch bonnet. And then, of course, tomatoes and then just random things I have growing over in the other garden space right there. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Um, pretty long day, but I feel accomplished. Um, I think we have a low of like 48 degrees tonight, so I'm not worried about freezing. So I hope they do well. Um, yeah, it's a nice evening though. I'm going to go in, take a nice shower, and I will catch you guys on relax a little bit. I always like run my sentences along. It's kind of crazy. What I'm trying to say is I'm going to go in, take a shower, relax, and I will catch you guys on the next video. I can see all the animals running around out here right now. They better leave my stuff alone. Bye y'all. Good morning you guys. So it's the next day. Um, I realized that I hadn't ended the video um, yesterday. So it is about eight o'clock in the morning, uh, April 10th, nope. April 12th. I'm way, way behind. Um, by the way, welcome to my channel. My name is Simply Natu. And uh, I hope you find it. Oh my gosh, there's something wrong with my gate. I hope you enjoy the video. I hope you stick with it so that you can like and subscribe. Okay? All right. So last night I planted my garden and I wanted to come up and see how they're doing so i'm gonna flip you guys around so you can take a look to see what it looks like this morning after i'm very pleased right now looking at it i'm sorry i'm not even had the camera in my face i was just staring at the garden very pleased with what it looks like right now it looks amazing okay hold on so this is what i'm looking at guys so this is the pepper bed one of the pepper beds and they have perked up nicely it looks like they are loving being in the ground over there here is the tomatoes I got some tomatoes and uh, the brandy wines right here the yellow pear and then super sweet 100 and everybody seems to be loving it yay okay guys um, see you in the next video thanks for watching I hope you like, subscribe, and hopefully hit that notification bell so that anytime I upload a video, you guys will be notified. Have a great day, y'all.